Oh my god, you see Simone, look at them. Look at her. All right, there you go. All right. Atsuma. Oh yeah, she she's eating like uh, like cockroach or any other insect. And oh yeah, it seems they're enjoying it. It seems it's, it's like a candy for them. Wow. Very good. Awesome. So we're right now in Dongmen and this is like the old area of Shenzhen, like old area. It's very noisy. Today is Monday, so there's not a there's not a lot of people here. But usually weekends is super crowded. A lot of people. This is located in Luohu district and basically people come here for more local food or they just want to buy some cheap stuff in this area. So back in time when China started to open to the world, the very first McDonald's they opened in mainland China, it was for that one over here. Very first one. Back in time when Xinjiang was created, it was created as a special economic zone. So the very first place in China where they started experimenting with uh, some international restaurants like McDonald's or KFC, it was Shenzhen. So that McDonald's, that place, is part of the history of China. If you're looking for a quiet place in Shenzhen, it's not here. It's so, so, so loud. These are just the people. Like stores, they do have speakers. Like trying to attract more clients, more people, and sell more products. And not only speakers, they do have people like clapping, making noise. Oh my god, this is really overwhelming sometimes. One of my videos I was showing you some strange flavors or ice cream that you can find here in China. So today I decided to give a try to one of these exotic flavors which is green bean. It's not lemon, it's not lime, it's green bean, so let's try it, so let's try it, so let's try it. Now it's, it's very sweet, it's good, but still beans are for soup, not for sweet. Kind of good. So, what I'm gonna have now is the uh, stinky tofu. Very oily, and I asked without spice because 
had a like spicy food. It smells really bad. It's stinky dog water all. Not that bad. Although it's spicy. Okay, I told him not that spicy, but he's spicy. So, level of spices here are different. So this is one small rooftop we found in the middle of Dongmen. I don't think there are many people know about this place. It is really beautiful because you have a very nice view of the traditional kind of old buildings that you can find here in Dongmen. I really like this place and at night it's even more beautiful because you have the whole scene combined with the light. In the back of this area, you can see all the modern buildings of Shenzhen. Oh my god, these are cockroach. Hello. Hello. These are cockroach. As she say they are they taste good. Like she's so convinced. Yes, I Oh my god, this is the moment. Look at them. Look at her. Alright, there you go. Alright. Oh yeah, she she's eating like uh, like cockroach or any other insect. And oh yeah. It seems they're enjoying it. It seems it's, it's like a candy for them. Wow. Very good, awesome. One of the crowded areas in Shenzhen, there's a lot of people, especially because today is holiday. So a lot of people go out, forget about social distance. Today, which is a holiday, you'll see a lot of people in the streets. Very small space, they don't really respect it as uh, the distance between one and the other. So they just stay together. If you like the content of my channel, consider subscribing and hit the bell button so you don't miss any of my videos. And of course, remember like the video. If you think there might be somebody else interested in this kind of content, please consider sharing.